morning at the Aurora Diner, live with the Where, Where's Mark segment for the Steel County Times. And today is Saturday, and there's just two days left of this fair, this great fair that's going on. The biggest fair in the state of Minnesota. And I kind of wanted to let you guys know what was going on today. It's going to be a beautiful day. Uh, bring your sunblock and uh, come out and have a good time. Bring your Pepto Bismol because I'll tell you what, I've eaten at that food court. It is absolutely incredible. The food court is actually the whole, the whole fair. But this morning, I want to make you aware of a place called the Aurora Diner. It's right here on the northern part of the fairgrounds. And they make the most delicious breakfast that you could ever hope to find. And it's for a good cause. They call in all these volunteers and volunteers get paid for their churches, for their scholarship funds, for their missions work. And these people come in and donate their time during the fair. And this place is popping early in the morning, long before the fair opens. All the farmers come in for breakfast here and it's a, it's a great place to come for some food. It's called the Aurora Diner, just a little uh, diner on the northern side of the fairgrounds, but I'll tell you what, if you want some good food where you can sit down and enjoy it, come here to the Aurora Diner. Well today, we've got on the United Prairie Banks Fair stage, uh, Dan Sturgis Band is at 11.30, 1 o'clock is the Mary Niesel Band, 2.15 Dan Sturza comes back again, 3.30 Mary Niesel comes back again, at 5 o'clock we have the one Wanniger Band, and at 7 o'clock we have Angie Dunyan and Joanne Holly. Then at 8.30 it finishes up tonight with the Stormy River Band, so you want to come out for that. Hopefully the, the, storm, or the, the Stormy River Band, or the Snowy River Band, Stormy, I need my glasses. It's the Snowy River Band. And, um, well, I know we don't like to use that S word here in Minnesota too soon because we know it's coming. But uh, let's enjoy this last part of summer. On the KRFO and KAT country stage, we have the seat spinning contest at 120. At 2 o'clock, we have Stanley Kozlowski Band. At 4 o'clock, there's Marion's Concertina Band. 505 Nail Driving Contest. You can't use a nail gun. And um, then at 5.45 we have American Pie and at 7.30 we have the Adam Wayne Band. So again, great things going on on the country stage. At the Elmer Riesland stage tonight we have um, uh, Enticing Entertainment at 2 and 5 o'clock and the Thank a Farmer at 1, 3 and 5 p.m. A great event here at the Steel County Fair. Thank a farmer and the Elmer Riesling stage. At the Village of Yesteryear stage today, we have the uh, EUMC choir at 1 o'clock. We have Todd uh, up to Dell at 2 o'clock. We have the Dogs at 3 o'clock. Lear Brothers are here at 4. 5 o'clock, we have Red Tangerines. Oh, Bad Tangerines. And then we have the Dance Stirs, a band at 6, at 7 o'clock, Dave Williams will be here. And then we have the Pumper, Kettle, and Politician Show. So, we want you to come out for the Village of Yesterday stage tonight at the Beer Garden. You're coming in to drink a few beers and listen to some good music. You'll want to come in um, today at 3 p.m. because Lead Penny's going to be here uh, later on this afternoon. And then tonight, um, always a crowd favorite. Jacqueline Rose is going to be here. She brings down the house. And um, you're not going to miss that at the Beer Garden stage. Again, we have many great attractions going on still here today. The Auto Museum is here. The uh, Organic Crops exhibit is here. We've got over 500 commercial vendors here at the fair this year. And uh, we also have the Equine Hall of Fame. Uh, livestock, animals, shows. It promises to be another great Fair Day here in Owatonna, Minnesota at the Steel County Street Fair. So we want you to come and be a part and enjoy your day at the fair. Again, this is the Where's Mark segment sponsored by the Steel County Times. If you don't have a subscription, get one and read some of the things that I write. I'm sure you'll enjoy it. And if you don't, send me a letter. See you at the fair.
And your name is what? Jody Cack. Jody Cack. And are you a pastor here, or are you just no? I'm here? not a pastor. So what do you you run the Aurora Diner though, right? Nope, just the kitchen in the morning. Kitchen in the morning, and it gets pretty busy in the morning, doesn't it? Does, it does, yep. So what? Everybody comes here when from the barns and the stalls. And from all over, yep. A lot of get a lot of 4-H people, a lot of FFA people, just people who are here early in the mornings. I mean, this place is packed, and the fair isn't even open yet. What's your secret? That's a good food, home good cooked food. food. At a reasonable price, right? And they can sit down and eat. Awesome, awesome. Well, I sure thank you for uh, coming on camera with us today. This is Steel County Times, and you're on the Where's Mark segment. And uh, we're going to give a look ahead of what's going to happen at the fair today. Thanks. All right. Cook them pancakes. Oh, you got sausage in here. Breakfast sausages, eggs. Are you the are you the egg expert here? Oh, that's him. Oh, this is the egg expert right here. And what's your name? Greg Spatanka. Greg Spatanka. Yeah. So how long have you been doing this, Greg? Uh, yeah. Six years. It's fun to do this. What's that? Are you a volunteer here? Yep. Yep. Our church, St. John Lutheran from Havana Township, we help the church out one over, day a week. So. Over in Claremont? Yep. All right. Sounds great. Well, God bless you in your efforts and uh, on your scholarship raising. I know that you raise money for your scholarships yep. over there. So, yep. well, it's good to see you, and it looks absolutely delicious. Got to burn my bacon a little more than that, though. That's still Lincoln.